Well, hello guys. So today we'll be going through a simple fun animation on how to switch from one scene in Flash to the other scene and um, back and forth, okay? So for this animation, we action, action script 2 works best. So let's click that. All right, so we have our canvas there. All right, so we're going to create like a simple little math game, okay? So I'm going to do something like five, Plus three equal eight. And I have a question sign. Let's change the color from red to a dark blue. All right, so we'll have that. Then we're going to give the user two options. That is either, either true, right? I'm going to put true in a different color, green, or it's false. I'm going to put false. In red, All right? Take on this tool, just fix them up like this. So, so the user have two options, and this is scene one. Okay, we're going to go now to insert scene. Now we have scene two. So, like I said, this is just for demonstration purposes. So, we're going to assume that the user is going to click true. So, this is what we're going to be using for the button true. So, what you want to do is right click it. Convert to symbol, click here, click button, give it a name, you can probably call it true. Alright, okay, and there you notice how it slightly changed with this border around it and the circle in the middle. So let's right click that again. Let's go action, and you're going to type this on release, comes up. All right, so open curly brace, enter. I'm gonna say go to and play. Open C, open code C. That's all you need to type for that. So we're going to go to scene 2 now that whenever the user clicks true, right, it takes them to scene 2 and we want scene 2 to say you win. Okay, so we're going to create a nice little animation for this. You win. Alright, let's change the color to this purple. Looks good. Alright. So I'm going to do this in a movie scene where we have, whenever it plays, it will continue playing unless I stop it because that's the purpose of the movie scene, right? It continue plays, it plays, it plays, it plays until you decide to put in a stop um, command or a stop script, All right? So what we do, like we just did with the first one, right click, convert to symbol, look for movies, movie clip, right? You can put winner for the name. Okay, now you realize it's right here, so you're going to double click it. Now we're in the movie scene, right? Which is called Winner. So let's just get a slight animation where you'd have some pretty circles um, coming up when it says you win, so it doesn't look plain and boring. Alright, so on this scene, we're going to do like this draw a little ball right there. Let's change the color green. Alright, so what we're going to do is copy this. Copy, click at 5, let's say F6 right there, paste the red ball, put it below. F6, paste. So this is what we're going to do, just duplicate the ball and change the color so that it will look nice and flashy whenever the movie starts to run. So we're going to do for every five frames. So you just click in it, F6. We're going to do that for all of them. So we're just going to create a few balls here and change up the color so you can follow along.
so we're gonna go build one now. Then go find some random colors. Twenty-five F six. Control V please carry it down. Alright, we're gonna change that color also. We'll come again. Five more frames F six. So that's the movie scene so whenever you're finished with the movie scene right here you see you just click back scene 2 so you don't have to worry about all of that it will play just the way we do it a while ago you'll see the effect after this all right so we have that right there so let's put in go back to scene 1 all right all right so we're in scene 1 now if you notice we're going to play this and you're going to see what happened control enter going to be switching in between we don't want that so in order for us to have control over scene one so that it can take us to scene two we have to put in what is called a stop script right so let's create a new layer we're going to call this stop all right and right here and there we're going to click right click it action now we're just going to type stop open bracket close bracket and uh, semicolon then we close that that's all we have to do with that if we run it again look what happens all right click see the other one it won't really go to you win like that because you win has no stop stop script on it so let's go to scene 2 now do the same thing create a new layer type stop and then go on the, the, the frame right click action type stop semicolon and close all right so this should give us a very good scene and help us to switch from scene one to scene two all right so let's run it again and see what happens all right so there we go so we come and we decide to click true see you win gives you a nice little animation with the balls flowing like it's celebrating and if you wanted to switch back you could have a button right here okay let we could do like this we could have a button right here let's use a text let's put it right here and say back let's make it smaller let's make it about 20. right and we're gonna put that on a new layer put it right there and call this one so we're gonna right click it, convert to symbol. We're gonna go to button. Let's call this back and click OK. Alright. So okay, let's cut this from this and put it on this. I had it on the wrong layer. Alright. Alright. So let it stay there. So we're gonna right click and we'll go action and we're going to type the same thing that we did on open release enter open, open curly brace go to and play this time we're going to say scene wait open quotes scene one close code comma and you're going to play frame one and that's it then we close it all right so let's run this and see what happens control enter all right so the answer is true so uh, we can click back see true okay let's carry down the, the button a little more since it's so far off all right come again control enter here we go again true yes see now we can go back so you see this is a very fun activity to do hope you learned something today guys please like and subscribe and leave your comments below